Okay, section 8.4, procedures and pharmacology, gynecology. Gynecologic diagnostic procedures. Palpitation is routinely used to feel the structures of the re reproductive system. A laparoscopy directly examines the uterus, fallopian tubes, and ovaries through a laparoscope inserted into the abdominal cavity through a small incision in the abdominal wall. Uh, carbon dioxide can be pumped through the lap laparoscope <laughs> to inflate the abdominal cavity so that the pelvic organs can be seen more clearly. A cervical biopsy is a procedure to remove tissues from the cervix for pathological testing for precancerous lesions of cervical cancer. Col colposcopy uses an instrument with a magnifying lens and a light called col uh, colposcope to examine the lining of the vagina and cervical canal. Both colposcopy and cervical biopsy are often performed because a pap test wa result was abnormal. Hysteroscopy is the examination of the inside of the uterus using a thin, flexible, lighted tube called a stereoscope to look for abnormalities of the cervical canal and endometrium. Uh, hysteroscopy is a procedure in which x-rays hysteroscopograms are taken after radiopaque dye is injected through the cervix into the uterus through a slender catheter to outline the uterus, the interior of the uterus and fallopian tubes. It can be used to help define the cause of female infertility or to confirm that a sterilization process to block the uterine tubes is successful. This is a hysterosalpingogram. <laughs> I'll figure out how to say that in a little bit. Okay. Endometrial biopsy, a biopsy of the lining of the uterus is performed to determine the cause of abnormal uterine bleeding and to check the effects of hormones on the endometrium, dilation and cuterage, DNC, cuterage, is a surgical procedure in which the cervix is dilated so that the cervical canal and uterine endometrium can be scraped to remove abnormal tissues for pathological examination. Loop electrosurgical excision procedure, LEEP, uses a wire loop heated by electricity to remove tissue from the vagina and cervix for pathological examination. After complete history and physical examination, including vagina and pelvic organs, other diagnostic tools to determine the causes for infertility include hormone blood levels of progesterone, and estrogens, and FSH. Um, Hysteroscope. Hysterosalpingogram. Hysterosalpingogram, in which x rays of the uterus and uterine tubes are taken after dye is injected through the uterus through a slender catheter. Ultrasound of the abdomen, which can show the shape and sound of the uterus, and the vaginal ultrasound, which can show the shape and size of the ovaries. Hysteroscopy, which can visualize the inside of the uterus and can be used to be taken endometrial biopsy to remove polyps and fibroids. Laroscopy, which allows inspection of the outside and the, of the uterus and ovaries and removal of any scar tissue blocking tubes. Postcoital testing, in which the cervix is examined soon after unprotected intercourse to see if sperm can travel through the uterus. Ultrasound exams are performed as transabdominal or transvaginal, depending on what is being evaluated. These exams are used to look for possible causes of pelvic pain, locate an intrauterine device, IUD, or look for possible reasons or, uh, for infertility. A swab from the vagina, mouth, throat, rectum, or area around cervix is used to determine the presence of STI. The swab is sent to a laboratory for testing. Hysteroscopy has multiple purposes, such as visualizing an IUD or a moving scar tissue. Okay, what do we have here? We've learned biopsy. Biopsy. Opsy to view wildlife. Removal of living tissue for laboratory examination. We have 
Colposcopy. Colposcopy, examination of vagina and cervix with an endoscope. Calposcope. Uh, calposcope, an endoscope to view the vagina and cervix. Conization. Conization, um, surgical excision of a cone shaped piece of tissue. Cryosurgery. Cryosurgery, use of liquid nitrogen or argon gas to freeze and kill tissue. Cytologist. Cytologist is a specialist in the study of cells. Curate. A curate is French for cleanse. Uh, age, oh, okay, excuse me. Curate is to cleanse. Instrument with sharp edges for scraping. Curatage. A curatage is scraping of the interior of a cavity. Dilation. Dilation, Latin to spread out. Um, artificial enlargement of an opening or hollow structure. Excision. Excision, surgical removal of a part or all of a structure. Hysterosalpingogram. Hysterosalpingogram, hystero uterus, scalping uterine tube, gram, a record. Radiograph of uterus and uterine tubes after injection of contrast material. Hysterosalpingogram, hysteroscope. Hysteroscopes, endoscope to visually examine the uterine canal or cavity. Hysteroscopy is visual examination of the uterine cavity. Immunosuppression. Immunosuppression, suppress, pass under, immuno, immuno response. Eon is process, suppression of the immune system. Laparoscope. A laparoscope, scope, instrument for viewing, lapros, abdomen, endoscope to view the contents of the abdomen. Laparoscopy. Laparoscopy is endoscopic examination of the contents of the abdomen. Palpate. Palpate to examine with fingers and hand. It's Latin to touch. It's a verb. Palpation. Palpation is a noun. Uh, palpate meaning touch or stroke. Examination using the fingers and hands. Pap test. A pap test uh, is named after George Papan Nicolai or Nicola O, who was born 1883, died 1962, a Greek U.S. physician and cytologist. So a pap test, pap test. Uh, examination of cells taken from the cervix. Post. Post coital. Coital. Coit. Oh, coital. Post coital. <laughs> Coit. Sexual intercourse. Post after. Okay, after sexual intercourse. Post coital. Screen. Screen and test determine a test to determine the presence or absence of a disease. Screening, a testing process that determines the presence or absence of a disease. Screen is a system for separating. Swab, Swab. is a wad of cotton. Old English to sweep. Ultrasound. Ultrasound, ultra meaning higher, sound is a noise, very high frequency sound waves. Pap test, uh, screens for cervical cancer. In a pap test, the doctor brushes cells from the cervix. The cells smeared onto a slide to rinse or rinse into a special liquid and sent to the laboratory for examination. This test enables abnormal cells, precancerous or cancerous, to be detected in the most successful and accurate tests for early detection of abnormalities. Current screening guidelines were last updated March 2012 with the National Cancer Institute. The American Cancer Society and other national organizations, according to the guidelines, pap test should, include, uh, should be scheduled as follows. Initial pap test, age 21, age 21 to 29 every three years, age 30 to 65, PAP and HPV contesting every five years or PAP alone for every three years. Age 65 onward, continued screening of risk factors are present including HIV infection, immunosuppression, previous treatment for precancer, cervical lesions, or cervical cancer. Uh, schedule individually with your doctor. Any abnormal result at any age mandates working out the best schedule for follow-up testing with your doctor. A PAP test is best performed 10 to 20 days after the first day of the last menstrual period. Normal cells and dysplastic cells. What a pap test. Oops, scrape some cells. Okay. Let's see. More than 90% of abnormal papanucolo pap smears 
Abnormal pap smears are caused by HPV infections. A vaccine is now available that can prevent lasting infections from the two HPV strains that cause 70% of cervical cancers and another two strains that cause 90% of genital warts. Gynecological therapeutic procedures. Gynecologic uh, surgical procedures can take place in the office of an operating room. And the office procedures, including those for cervical cancer. Treatment for cervical cancer depends on the stage of the cancer. In pre-invasive cancer, when it's only the outer layer of the lining of the cervix, treatment can include conization, a cone-shaped piece of tissue from around the abnormality is removed with a scalpel, a loop electrosurgical excision procedure, LEEP, a wire loop carries an electrical current to slice off cells from the mouth of the cervix. Laser surgery, a laser beam is used to kill precancerous and cancerous cells. Uh, cryosurgery is a uh, freezing to you uh, is used to kill the precancerous and cancer cell dilation and cuterage DNC involves dilating the entrance of to the uterus through the cervix so that the, the thin instrument can be inserted to scrape this and section or section away the lining of the uterus and take deep uh, tissue samples endometrial ablation ab ab is a heat generating tool or a laser removes or destroys the lining of the uterus and prevents or reduces menstruation. Endometrial ablation is used only in women who do not plan to have future children. Surgery can be performed via laparotomy, laparoscopy, robot-assisted laparoscopic surgery uses sophisticated robotic surgical tools through a laparoscope. Gynecologic uh, surgery performed in an operating room can be approached via the abdomen uh, vagina or laparoscopy. Uh, ray, okay, and then the hysterectomy. Hysterectomy removal of the uterus is performed because of uh, uterine fibroids, uterine cancer, and endometriosis. Radical hysterectomy removes the whole uterus, the cervix, and the top of the vagina. Ovaries also may be removed. Total hysterectomy is removal of the whole uterus and cervix. Sub hysterectomy or subtotal hysterectomy is removal of the upper uterus, leaving the cervix in place. An oophorectomy is surgical removal of one or both ovaries. Treatment of rectocele, cyst, or cyst cell, and prolapse of other pelvic organs depends on the severity of symptoms. Physical therapy is a non-surgical option directed at strengthening pelvic floor muscles. Another surgical option is an individually fitted vaginal Pestiary inserted into the vagina, which supports pelvic organs. A sacral uh, cul uh, culpopexy surgery treats pelvic organ prolapse by suspending the vagina vault to the sacral promontory using a graft or surgical mess or mesh. Colporophy is a surgical repair of vaginal wall because of a cytosol protrusion of the urinary bladder into the vagina or a rectocele protrusion of the rectum into the vagina. A salpingectomy may be necessary in women who has salpingitis that has developed into a pelvic abscess. Tubal li li ligation prevents future pregnancies. Uh, treatment options for fibroids are numerous and include expectant management or watchful waiting. A myomectomy, removal of the fibroids surgically, leaving the uterus in place. Hormone therapy, which uses GnRH agonists, agonists to cause estrogen and progesterone levels to fall so that menstruation stops and fibroids shrink. Hysterectomy is major surgery that is performed by many gynecologists as last resort. Uh, endometrial cancer is staged at the time of any surgical procedure into four groups, depending on its localization into the uterus of or it's spread outside. Surgery is the most common treatment. If the cancer has spread to other parts of the body, progesterone therapy, radiation therapy, and chemotherapy are used. Infertility treatment is directed at the underlying cause. Um, if the cause of infertility is infrequent ovulation, the patient can be treated with hormones to stimulate release of the egg. These hormones include um, clomiphene, citrate, and injectable forms of FSH, LH, NG, and RH. Surgical procedures initiate pregnancy include in arterian insemination, sperm are inserted into uh, directly into the uterus via a special catheter or in vitro fertilization IVF. Eggs and sperm are combined in a laboratory dish and two resulting embryos are placed inside the uterus. This can result in twins. Okay, words we've learned for gynecologic therapeutic procedures.
Ablation. Ablation. Removal of tissue to destroy fu its function. Late to take ab away from ischion. Action. Culpapexy. Culpapexy. Pexy is a surgical fixation and culp. Colpo is another word for vagina. Surgical fixation of the vagina. Colporophy. Colporophy. Ruffy uh, is suture and colpo is vagina. Suture of a rupture of the vagina. Conization. Conization. Surgical excision of a cone shaped piece of tissue. Cryosurgery. Cryosurgery is use of liquid nitrogen, argon gas to probe and freeze and kill abnormal tissue. Curet. Curate is scoop-shaped instrument scraping the interior cavity and removing new growths. Curatage. Uh, curatage is scraping of the interior cavity. Curate is to cleanse. Did I already read these? Mm, no, okay. Let's see. Electrosurgical. Electrosurgical. Okay, use of electric current to remove tissue. We have hysterectomy. Hysterectomy. Surgical removal of the uterus. In vitro fertilization. Um, okay, fertile, able to conceive. Let's see, process of combining sperm and egg in a laboratory dish and placing the resulting embryos inside the uterus. <laughs> Insemination is the introduction. Insemination. Of semen into the vagina, vagina. Yeah, semen and semen into. The, okay, inseminate is semen into the vagina. Inseminate. It's a verb. Then we have ligature. Ligatures or ligature. Thread or wire tied around a tubal surface uh, structure to close it. Ligate. A ligate is a verb for ligature. Is a use or a tie. To close a tube. Ligation. Ligation is a noun, meaning to tie off a structure such as a bleeding blood vessel. Myomectomy. A myoect myomectomy, surgical removal of a fibroid. Oophorectomy. Oophorectomy is surgical removal of the ovary or ovaries. Pessary. Pessary, Greek for an oval stone, an appliance insert, uh, inserted into the vagina to support the uterus. Salpingectomy. Salpingectomy is surgical removal of the uterine tubes. Vestibulectomy. Vestibulectomy is surgical excision of the vulva. Vestibule. Vestibulectomy. Meaning vestibule meaning entrance ectomy is surgical excision. Salpingectomy. Salping is fallopian tube ectomy is surgical excision. Gynecologic pharmacology, hormone replacement therapy, HRT medications to relieve menopausal symptoms by replacement of diminishing of diminished circulating estrogen and progesterone hormones. They have to be given in effective forms. Estrogen, when taken orally, is converted by the liver to estrogen, a weaker estrogen. When estrogen as the synthetic estradiol is used transdermally as a patch, gel, or vaginal pessiary. It enters the bloodstream as a more effective bioidentical estrogen with fewer side effects. Similarly, micronized bioidentical progesterone is more effective and has fewer side effects than synthetic progestin. progestin. However, long-term long hormotherapy, as it's now called, is no longer routinely recommended when taken for more than a few years as an increase of breast cancer. Okay, hormone therapy can be used... Oh my god. Alright. <clears throat> Ooh, that's nice. Okay. Hormone therapy can be used on uh, the treatment of fibroids. GnRH agonists to cause estrogen and progesterone levels to fall so that administration stops and fibroids shrink. If the cause of infertility is infrequent ovulation, the patient may be treated with hormones to stimulate release of the egg. Uh, these hormones include uh, clomiphene, citrate, and injectable forms of SHH, LH, and GnRH. Bacterial venenosis is treated with antibiotics such as chlamydia, uh, chlamydiacin and vulvovaginal candidiasis can be treated by applying myconazole 
or Monisa or Cloach or Muzzle, Desinex vaginally, and if necessary, taking fluconazole or Diflucan orally. Treatment for STDs. Trichomoniasis infection of the vagina can be treated with a single oral dose of metronidazole or flagyl or or tinidazole, tinidamax, because it is a ping pong infection between partners. Both individuals should be treated. Treatment for chlamydia is with oral antibiotics such as doxycycline or urethromycin or azithromycin. Gonorrhea can be treated with a single dose of antibiotic uh, uh, ceftriaxone. It's causative agent Neisseria gonorrhea (laughs) is developing resistance to antibiotics. Antibiotics such as azithromycin and ceftriaxone are effective in the treatment of cancroid. The lesions of molluscum contagiosum are treated with a potophyllin ointment or liquid nitrogen and laser surgery can be used. There is no cure for genital herpes. Three antiviral medications can provide clinical benefit by limiting the replication of the virus. These are a cyclovir um, or Zovin, Zovirax, uh, Vast Cyclovir, which is Valtrex, and Fam Cyclovir, Famver. In people who have recurrent outbreaks, medication taken every day can reduce the recurrences by 78%. The HPV vaccine, uh, Gardasil, is offered to girls and women aged 9 to 26 and boys and men of the same age group. There is no cure for HIV or AIDS, but combinations of anti HIV medications are taken to stop the replication of the virus in the cells of the body and stop the progression of the disease. Development of resistance to the drugs is a problem. So the words we have learned. Ooh. Oh, yeah. We have estradiol, the most potent natural estrogen. Estradiol. Estradiol. Synthetic. Synthetic is built up or put together from simpler compounds. Transdermal. Transdermal means going across the skin. Bioidentical. Uh, bioidentical is the same as what it is produced. What is produced in the body. And then micronize. Micronize is to reduce into a powder in which the particles are a few microns in length. <laughs> okay.